have got an awesome unboxing to show you guys today and you can probably already tell by the title but I'm going to be unboxing the Game of Thrones leather bound books box set and I am so stoked. Hello lovelies, my name is Mamta and welcome to my channel Geek Glitz in which I talk about all things geek and all things glitz. Now I'm into a lot of fandoms and Game of Thrones is one of them. I'm a huge fan of the show. I love it so much and I love dissecting and discussing each episode with my friends. And now since there's such a long wait until the next season, I mean 2019, I decided it's probably time for me to finally read the books, which is why I decided to get the box set. I've been meaning to read these books for ages, but I just enjoy the show so much that I didn't want to read the books and then get spoiled on plot points from some of the earlier seasons. Now I've heard the books do deviate from the show and the show has gone beyond the books so I thought now's the perfect time for me to finally start reading them. So normally I don't purchase many actual physical books anymore because I've got a Kindle but when I saw this box set I knew I had to have it and you'll see why when I open it up. So I got this box set from the Think Geek website a couple of months ago but I haven't opened it up yet and I got it for $39.99 which is the cheapest I was able to find it at the time. As of today, when I'm filming this video, I don't think ThinkGeek has this box set on their website anymore. So I'll put whatever link I can find down in the description so that you can check it out. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. So this box came inside the larger ThinkGeek box in which I had a couple of my other items. And this one holds the Game of Thrones leather cloth box set, Song of Ice and Fire series. And it says the publisher's Bantam. And it's actually, the date it is from 2015, but I got it much later. And the retail price is actually 75 US dollars and Canadian dollars 97. So I actually got it much cheaper. I'm gonna go ahead and open up this box. So here's the full set. It comes wrapped in this plastic. I'm gonna go ahead and open that up. So this box set is absolutely gorgeous and I can barely contain my excitement. It is in a nice brown leather, the box itself, and it says George R. R. Martin in silver metallic lettering on the front and it also says a song of ice and fire and it seems like nice and embossed in a way here. And then on the sides it says GRRM. So GRM as in George R. R. Martin, his initials. And what I really like is that the R's, they face in opposite directions. And then there's a sword that goes through it. And that makes a part of the R. So the two R's in opposite directions kind of gives it a nice symmetrical look. So I really like his initials the way it is over here. And then let's take a look at the back. It seems this is a pull out piece of paper, but it says the ultimate collector's item for fans of the epic fantasy series that inspired HBO's Game of Thrones. And if you want to pause the video and read up on this, you can. And I'm going to go ahead and pull this out. And let's get back to the front of this box. So there's five books in the box set, the first five in the series, and they're each leather bound and in a different color. And they're quite short, they're not that high, but they're quite thick in width, so I think they'll take a while to get through. And then the spines have silver lettering for the book names and the GRRM logo, and then there's a nice embellished border around it. So let's take a closer look at each of these books. So first is A Game of Thrones, and it's in a nice light blue color. And I like how the front simply has the title with the embellished border again, and it's quite simple, and then with the GRRM logo. And here's the spine again, a close look at it. And then the back is plain. Next, I've got A Clash of Kings, the second in the book. And it's got the same look, but it's in a dark blue color. And then we've got A Storm of Swords, and this is in a dark purplish color. And next, A Feast for Crows. And this is in a maroon color. And 
finally a dance with dragons and this is in a bright red color. So let's take a closer look at the inside of the book. As you can see, the lettering is quite small and the pages are pretty thin. So while flipping through, I'd probably want to be a little careful that I don't bend them too much. And I'd also want to be a little careful that I don't open up the book too much and like cause creases in the spine and the leather. I don't know if that would actually happen, but it's probably just a precaution that I would take just because it's such a beautiful set and I want to maintain its shape. So I think what really attracted me to this set was its design, the leather, and then the really vibrant colors. And it actually reminded me a lot of my deluxe Harry Potter set. So as you can see, the colors are pretty similar, like they've got a similar tone. So I thought they would look really good together. And here's a quick size comparison test and you can see that the Game of Thrones book is a lot shorter than the Harry Potter book. So overall, I am quite pleased that I got this set. And I know that George R.R. R. Martin will probably, hopefully, be coming out with the future books and they wouldn't match with this set. And that was something that I did consider before buying this set. But to be honest, I don't know when the future books will come out, so I went ahead and got this for now. At the very least, it's a great collector's item and perfect for a Game of Thrones fan like myself. So comment below and let me know what you think of this box set. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And please subscribe to my channel Geek Glitz for more things geek and more things glitz as I make videos every Tuesday and Friday. And feel free to connect with me on my other socials, which are all listed below in the description. I post daily pictures on Instagram, so come check me out and feel free to DM me to talk GOT and other fandoms or anything else. Thank you for watching, lovelies. See you in the next video. Bye!